We're fortunate here at Muscle Car of the Week that many people enjoy our videos, some of them receiving huge play counts on YouTube and Facebook, and we always appreciate the enthusiasm and support. However, we recently noticed that some of the great convertibles were not receiving very much attention. So we thought we'd spotlight a few of them, just in case they were somehow missed by the loyal subscribers and viewers of Muscle Car of the Week. First up is an awesome car, one of the eight 1969 Pontiac Trans Am convertibles ever built. While the 869 Trans Am convertibles might look the same because they all have the same blue and white paint scheme, there are differences between the cars. Four of them have automatic transmissions, the other four have stick shift. All of them have a blue interior except for one which has white seats. Some have blue tops, some have white, but this is the car that started the whole run. Yep, the very first 1969 Pontiac Trans Am convertible built, complete with a 400 cubic inch Pontiac V8 built to Ram Air 3 specifications under the hood. Too cool. If you'd like to see more of this car, head over to episode 217 of Muscle Car of the Week. Next up is a super sweet 1958 Chevrolet Corvette wearing signet red with snow crust white cove inserts. And it was a new design for 58 with a first ever Corvette styling element. Can you spot what it is? Check it out in episode 276 of Muscle Car of the Week. The Brothers Collection is full of amazing and rare convertibles. And this 1966 Plymouth Belvedere II convertible is a great example. And for those who feel convertibles aren't muscular, this one is featuring the legendary 426 Hemi under the hood. It's also unique in that it appears in surviving condition, having been a real car that was driven and had regular maintenance along the way. You can see more of this one of 10 built Hemi drop top in episode 228 of Muscle Car of the Week. This next car is an icon, the 1969 Chevrolet Camaro Indy 500 pace car. The color scheme is instantly recognizable, and these cars have an interesting storyline with that Indy 500 tie-in. It's powered by a 396 cube Chevy V8, and we share the story of the car and the 69 Indy race in episode number 277 of Muscle Car of the Week. Finally, we bring out an amazing 1971 Plymouth Cuda convertible, one that has it all, including an amazing color and a super fun 446 pack power plant under the hood. Take a lap with us in episode 155 of Muscle Car of the Week. We hope you're able to enjoy these muscle-bound drop tops as much as we did shooting these episodes, and we think they're all cool cars and deserve to be seen and appreciated by muscle car fans all around the world. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time on Muscle Car of the Week.